Hello YouTube, this is my queen's eye, back with another video, back with another message. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys for all the support, all the likes, comments, share, subscribes. Everything is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. So we just going to get started and see what comes out. Somebody had multiple um, multiple opportunities coming, but for for some of you, you could just be seeing like blessings out of nowhere. <laughs> that could also let you know like you're on the right path. Or that like the energy you've been putting out is coming back to you in ways unexpected here. We let me get a um let me get a prayer in. Most high loving ancestors of my highest good, my highest light, my highest frequency. Please help me to channel these messages clear and concise with truth and clarity. Please block any and all negative interference during this message. Please return to center tenfold. Thank you. <clears throat> we got the Ten of Cups here and the Nine of Wands. Everyone are fighting together here. Then we got the, the Tower with the Ace of Cups. Queen of Cups, Ten of Swords, the Five of Wands came out though. So with something with stability, it's something with a partnership, it's something with um properties too. If you left a home. It could be a tower could have hit or it's about to. Seven of Wands. Whatever the tower is, you could be the tower. Just take it how it resonates, but you were protected from it. Whatever it was. <laughs> Three of Swords, Page of Wands with the lovers. But it may be something that you see like on the news or online or something like that that may like hurt but like i said in the beginning you could be seeing blessings like out of nowhere like out of the blue it's a lot of blue out here heavy on the throat chakra the crown no the crown is purple third eye and throat chakra But you were protected from it, whatever it is. Could be something with gangs here, too. So if somebody, if you were staying in a home or a property or something like that, somebody could have been involved in like a gang or something like that. If you were at this residence wherever it is even if it's an apartment building or something like that you you were like the protection somebody could have felt like like wherever they were staying was like like a hideaway or a getaway or something like that i don't know who this is for but take it how it resonates I don't know if somebody felt like you left because you were scared of them being like gang affiliated here, but the tower is out here. <clears throat> and whoever they are, like if it's a neighbor or something like that, they're now like caught in this shit here. Having to defend themselves, having to stand up for themselves or something like that. Just take it how it resonates. I don't know who that's for.
I don't know if somebody feels like um, because you have favor or protection or something like that, that like you get away. Hmm. Knight of Swords or like you're able to get away from shit. But like I said in the beginning, you could be the tower. Because it's like if somebody was trying to start like an argument or a fight or become aggressive with you in some type of way to make you scared, like knowing they a part of a gang or something like that. It's like whatever shit that they was talking to you, they not going to be able to talk that shit now. Because people feel like if they if they see somebody that's like nice or... um heavy on the free spirit with the with the full energy coming out they really feel like those are people that they could like come up against and somebody learning a lesson here somebody's learning a lesson eight of cups seven of swords the will with the eight of pentacles and it's like whatever they were trying to like get you to walk away from or not accept or something like that. It's like you you just get right back to work. <laughs> so somebody could have just been waiting for like an argument or some type of fight or words being exchanged. Somebody could have been waiting for that. But it's like, why are you waiting for that when you like... Uh, approach a situation that way. Somebody not going to be prepared for this, whatever this tower is. But you know, that's energy that's returned. And whoever you are, like you just walked away. You just, you left it alone. Eight of cups to the three. That's five. <laughs> Wait. So whoever whoever you are, like if you move, it could be like worse people that come in after you. Where somebody think that they going to be able to do the same thing that they did to you. Try to start a fight. Try to become aggressive. Talk all that shit. And, and they're going to be fucking shook. They're going to be shook. And it's like whoever you are, like I said, with with this free spirit, it's like you walk away from from people, places, or things that really no longer serve your group. Because the Eight of Cups, um, after the Eight of Cups is the Nine of Cups. It's evolvement. It's growing. It's still growth. Pentacles. Yeah, somebody, you may see something. Or some, or it's something that you have said to somebody where they're going to be looking at it like differently, like discovering something about it. Because like I said, if you're a free spirit, you, you know, you work and everything like that, or however you do, however you move, if somebody didn't like it, they felt like you should have been moving like them. That's not how you move. And somebody going to come in like after you or something like that. And it's like, damn, I thought the last person was a problem, but now it's worse. <laughs> Nine of swords, six of swords. I already showed y'all the three. For some of you too, like if you left like, an establishment or a job or a house or something like that, you were guided to do so here. For some of you, you're about to like travel. We got the lovers here. Somebody could definitely be left out. 
Now, I haven't seen the Five of Pentacles, but Justice, Five of Cups, Two of Cups here with the Death, the Four of Cups, the Eight of Swords, the King of Pentacles, Ace of Swords, King of Wands. So if this was somebody that was um, dealing with another individual here, they left. If this was a home, somebody left. And left somebody to like deal with like whatever they have going on here. Somebody is learning a lesson like to keep their fucking mouth shut. Because if somebody was speaking some type of like. Like chaos over you or like some shit like that. They're now experiencing it. Justice with the Emperor here. Three of Cups. But then we got the Eight of Cups again. That's five. And the five is right here. <laughs> with the two. So take it how it resonates. And then the Six of Pentacles after the Eight of Cups. Like, whoever you are. So, I don't know if somebody is, like, was, like, stuck in a place. And you're able to, like, move freely or something like that. And whatever they were trying to, like, start or some shit like that, it has them, like, in some type of regret here. Because whoever you are... If you ended some type of partnership, I don't care what type of partnership it is. It wasn't like what they were expecting, Tower. <laughs> it's something about fumes. They can hide resonate. <laughs> But this just goes to show you, like, what happens when you not, like, in your own lane or staying in your place here. Because if somebody felt like they was going to cause some type of stagnation or something like that, it's like they can't do that. With the sun right here, they can't do that. Or at least they should not be able to. Because whoever they are, <laughs> five of cups with the devil now, whoever they are, it's like, that's like the spirit of fucking depression or some shit like that. For some of you, you could have felt that shit and just needed to move away or be guided away. Somebody, somebody about to get a tower here. Seven of Swords, Page of Swords, Empress here with the Ace of Pentacles, with the World, with the Hangman. You've had enough like the Lees and the Knight of Pentacles right here and the Three of Wands. Like you've had enough delays here. It's really time for you to be like in this sun energy celebrating the emperor is out here for some of you this emperor is coming towards you just take it how it resonates or you're going to be traveling somebody could be going on a vacation and if this was like something that somebody was trying to speak over you for you not to receive it's like they don't have like that power or that control And they don't like it. They don't like that. I don't know if this was somebody that was saying to themselves, like, I wish that person would, uh, like, 
speak like endings over me or lie on me or some shit like that. And it's like you, whoever you are, Empress, whether it's the Empress or the Empress, like you don't need to do that at all. You don't need to lie on somebody to make yourself feel good. You don't even need to talk shit to make somebody feel good. Somebody just don't like like their energy being returned because somebody here feels like they are like in control of you, of the way you move or some shit like that. And that's not the case. Somebody got left. Somebody definitely got left here. Or is you leaving a place? Just take it how it resonates. You got the Hierophant right here. Ten of Pentacles, Two of Swords. Ten of Wands. Heavy on the nothing being, nothing more being put on you than you can bear here. Ten of Wands with this strength. Hierophant, Ten of Pentacles, Two of Swords. Whether you can see it or not, whether you believe it or not, nothing is nothing more is put on you than you can bear here. Strength. <laughs> because every time you may feel like that, you always like, I wanted to say get over it, but you always overcome it. Have you on the seeing the silver lighting or the silver lining? It's like you always try to see good in a situation, probably until you can't see it anymore. <laughs> oh, wait. Five of swords, temperance energy with the hangman, with the devil, with the hermit, <clears throat> with the queen of cups, the king of cups, the ten of swords. Queen of Pentacles. The Eight of Swords. King of Swords, Eight of Cups, Six of Pentacles here, Three of Wands. Somebody got fucking left. It's like the fourth time I done seen the Eight of Cups. Five of Swords with the King of Swords. <laughs> Somebody needs to stay ready here. King of Cups. Four of Wands with the Five of Pentacles here. Four of Swords, Six of Cups. Somebody got fucking left, yo. Somebody got left by a person, somebody. So if the person that, so if this is dealing with like um some type of house or housing or some shit like that, somebody left <laughs> and they not going to be able to like pay the bill or some shit like that. And it's like, whoever you are, it's like, you could create opportunities for yourself. Maybe that's what somebody needs to learn here with the Page of Pentacles, how to create like an opportunity or opportunities for themselves. You could have done that. Just take it how it resonates. Or you're just not afraid to like... Go to the next thing. Whether somebody want to believe it or not. And I don't know if this is you like not listening to, um, to what people say anymore. It's like, oh, don't do that. Don't do that. And it's like you do what works for you. <laughs> whether it's you saying it or somebody else. Like 
whatever somebody heavy on the not listening to the naysayers here. Because whatever somebody is like, oh, you might as well stay here. You might as well do that. You might as well do this. Guess what? If you decide to do that, but that's not what you're being guided to do, you're going to get fucking karma. You're going to get a tower. So this is, or this could be like somebody always like speaking something over you, but you not listening because whoever is speaking it or saying it to you is just like, why would I even be taking your advice any fucking way? Knowing that all the shit that you done already been through, like I said, the Most High is not going to put more on you than you can bear. So it's like now at this point in your life, if you overcome like a whole lot of shit, it's like whatever you're doing now is just like, oh, that's like heavy on the easy breezy, yo. Yeah, it's going to be work that you need to put in, but ultimately, like at the end of the day, you're going to make out good, probably better than expected. And somebody just does not want that for you. Because it's clear if they're trying to speak some type of trauma or uh, keep you in your head or some shit like that, it's clear that they can't even speak goodness like in or like to themselves. Because whoever this is, like you don't need like their input. Like, why are you trying to give your two cents? What is it worth? And somebody don't like that. Like, like I don't know if somebody feel like you got too much heart. King of Cups with the strength here. Like, you too bold or too brave. But it's like, how are you too brave? <laughs> Especially knowing that the multi has you, y'all. Regardless, how can you be too bold or too brave to do anything? Because whoever is speaking something or trying to like scheme or scam or some old shit, it's clear like whatever they're going through, they feel like it's too much. But it's the way you look at it. We got the temperance energy here. Queen of Cups. Page of Cups here. And then the judgment peeking through. Somebody don't like when you say or that you're able to say, you know what, enough is enough. With this judgment here, somebody don't like that shit. Somebody don't like that you're able to even do that. Because maybe you were timid. Maybe you were shy. Maybe you were like paranoid to do certain things. Maybe you always cried like or had some type of fear of something not working out or you moving. And you got to a point where, you know what, full energy. What the fuck do I have to lose? Because I know that the shit that I've already been through and gotten over, I can like endure or overcome whatever is to come. Take it how it resonates. I don't know who needs to hear this, but it's clearly somebody does. Even if it's just like for myself. I'm in with the devil with the hangman here. You got somebody hiding. We got the hermit, the devil, the hangman, the star, and the magician. <laughs> I, just, I said this the other day. Like, you put somebody to shame. Whoever in this energy, hermit, devil, with the hangman, you put this person to shame here. 
just by you being or staying happy, just by you like protecting your energy, you you having that much faith in the most high, having on a mustard seed of faith, yo. Somebody don't even have a mustard seed of faith. That shit can get you so far. And somebody trying to figure out how you how you made it or how you made something happen. Come on. Who are you really asking? Because like I said earlier, this somebody that be speaking this type of shit, like things to to make you worry or uh-uh, they going to set you up. Oh, uh-uh, they, they going to do that. They like instilling all type of fear in you or that's what they trying to do. It's somebody who don't even have a mustard seed of faith, though. The mustard seed of faith is going to overcome all of that fear, yo. You just got to move. Somebody's stuck. They can't move. But you're able to, like, move freely here. <laughs> and they don't like that shit. But, you know, that's their problem. Like, that's a personal problem. Don't got shit to do with, with the Empress or the Emperor or this Ten of Cups out here. Because it's clear that whoever you guys are, you know what it is to put in work. To have that mustard seed of faith and say, you know what? Let me just do this shit. Because what do they say? Like, on the other side of, on the other side of fear is, like... Uh, happiness or abundance or something like that. You're about to step into that or walk into it. Take it higher, resonate. So it's like whatever little blessings that could be big blessings, don't get it fucked up now because it'd be the smallest shit. It'd be the small shit. Page of Pentacles, it'd be the small shit. But at the end of the day, it's like if you're starting to see like more little things happen that are blessings, keep that's that's the most high helping you keep your vibration high. You gotta be careful of the naysayers or the naysayer. Just take it how it resonates. High priestess here, and you already know, you could already know who this person is. Five of Pentacles, Four of Swords. Because whoever they are, whoever that naysayer is, they already know. Even though they refuse to believe, they already knew the high priestess just came out that five of pentacles to the four of swords. Where's your greatness? Somebody don't even believe in they in they self, yo. So in turn, that means that somebody don't want you to believe in you or they don't even believe in them. They can't they can't believe in themselves and and want to cause like fear or anxiety or endings. Like you can't believe in yourself if you're calling that type of shit over people's lives. Ain't no way you're not ever going to be great doing no shit like that. You're going to be just like this. <laughs> now, that's not great. But somebody, is somebody doing some type of research on like um, different principalities or something like that or evil spirits or I don't know. Happy on the being evaluated here. Because if this somebody that said, uh-uh, you need to go over there and go look at this person and look what they be doing. And they did this when they was a kid. And they did that when they was a kid. How fucking old are you, yo? How old are you? And when somebody look at you and somebody else, it's like, well, I can see the difference. 
faith could have been instilled in you since you were a child, probably from the womb here. Ace of Cups. I saw the Knight of Cups too. Because the Ace of Cups, the Page of Cups, the Queen of Cups is out here. And I saw the Knight of Cups. It's like you've always kept like faith here. Or you were like always blessed. Somebody don't like that you was always blessed, whether you saw it or not. You had to see it. <laughs> you had to stop listening to what other people were saying and do shit for yourself here. And somebody does not like that because they don't know how to do shit for themselves. They're codependent. That's also the devil energy. So it's like if you're always codependent on people and then those people are looking for growth or looking for evolvement or, or something different in life, they're not going to go back. <laughs> they're not going to go back. Somebody should have been codependent on the most high, not people, yo. Even though you have to be thankful like to the people to be thankful for the most high or thankful to the most high. Because the most high uses people to bless you in some type of way. Somebody only saw like codependency as a blessing. Oh, I can get this person to do that. Okay. I can get this person to do that. Okay. That's not what that should be about. Can you do it for yourself and then say, oh, shit, let me see if I can get such and such to help. Like something like that. Somebody just wanted like to be codependent on every fucking body. And now they have no one. And even if you, Empress, Emperor, whoever in your soul tribe, even if you don't have like a significant other, you Always going to have the most high because your mustard seed of faith will take you places you don't even fucking know. So will kindness, yo. But it's a difference when you're being kind and somebody just wants to be codependent on that energy. Because with the devil, it's like they're just going to drain that shit from you and you don't need that shit. You probably don't even need nothing from this person and they want you to be codependent, but they don't have shit for you to even be codependent on. Because they can't be talking about this fucking behavior. They want you to be codependent on. How, sweat? And leave out all of this greatness right here? Why the fuck would anybody want to do that? This is why they in the Five of Pentacles for Swords because it's literally killing them <laughs> for them to like know or understand now or take a heart resonate that you don't need them, yo. You don't need this person. And for some of you, maybe you had to like get out of that. Oh, I need this person to do this. I need this person to do that. And it's like, do you actually need them? Or do you want them to do it? Or do you want their services? Or is this something like that? Five of Cups, Knight of Pentacles, Three of Wands, Eight of Cups, like King of Swords, Nine of Pentacles, Seven of Cups here, Three of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles. Somebody is getting ready to... If somebody has left an individual, yo, they're about to see their life like, like go to the next level. Because whoever this is, five of cups, ten of wands here. <laughs> well, wait, will of fortune with the four of pentacles. Because at this point, it's just like, why, why, why are you, and I'm saying you like for the, the naysayer, like, why are you even still like wanting to put out energy that you know you're not going to receive back? You see the stupid shit. Cause it's like, up, uh, yeah. Oh, I'm feeling down and, and I'm going through so much. And if somebody in their head is like, yeah, I'm going to use that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try to get this to go in my favor. And then it's like, oh, let me pull all the way back. 
Because somebody don't have like something that you want. See, the needs and the wants, right? Somebody wants, but the wants is like what brings like the three of swords. Not your needs. I picked this up the other day. Somebody got their priorities fucked up. Because whoever this person is, like I said, they're just codependent on other people. They're fucking selfish. They don't give nothing in return. Now, I saw the Six of Pentacles, but it's not out here. The only thing that they want is fucking attention. They want to look good, yo. But see, this Ten of Wands is this Six and this Four. But some of you don't even like look for attention or ask for attention. And somebody's like, give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. Okay, well, we're going to give you what the fuck you want. You see? Because this somebody that be like, they don't even be thankful to me. And they're not even fucking thankful for every fucking thing they done already got. The house, the car, the money, the trips. All that shit. They're not even fucking thankful for that. They're not even thankful for life. And it's killing them. <laughs> it's killing them that you're thankful for life. You're thankful for support. You're thankful for the most high. You're thankful for, for every fucking thing, yo. And somebody just don't understand, like, you got every fucking right to really be out here celebrating. <laughs> Sky writing with the fates here. The star is out here. Preparations come to fruition. Said it the other day, like, what are you actually like preparing yourself for? Because if this somebody that's like, uh uh, you can't do that, uh uh, you can't do that, no, you shouldn't do this, no, you shouldn't do that, well, why the fuck should you like get the chance to do any fucking thing if you feel like somebody else can't do it? Like, it be that type of shit. It be that type of shit. We got Jewel Web here with the connectivity. Heavy on the you got the clarity and organization. Cause I was getting ready to say heavy on your mind being like a gold mine, like full of knowledge. The high priestess out here too. Like heavy on the crown that you wear is heavy. I did this video a minute ago. And somebody don't like that you can hold that shit. For some of you people can see it, for some they can't, but just know that it's there. Somebody is caught in the spider's web while like you're you're in this jeweled web. <laughs> like like you're <laughs> heavy on you being connected to the ancestors, yo. This somebody that's not connected to source in no way, shape, or form. Hermit, devil with the hangman. We got repairing the veil here. We got forgiveness. Have you on the understanding that forgiveness is for yourself? Because I said a minute ago, part home with the compassion. I said a minute ago, that's how I was able, me personally, revelation right here. That's how I was able to move forward. Like forgiving people that I felt like wasn't going to apologize. Like just healing from 
things that I remember just from my own childhood. Now, I have to say it again. Things that I remembered that I went through as a child, I had to heal from. And if somebody like came along on your path here and tried to open up like a closed wound or something you already let go, this is what's killing them. Because whoever this is, they did too much for them to even feel like you could heal from it. And it's fucking them up. Because heavy on the heart, heavy on the you having a lot of heart to do something or just to be like yourself. Because whoever you are, that's enough. You being yourself here. Somebody's trying to no, wear it like this. No, do it like that. Uh-uh. Just okay. Are you just gonna let this shit flow? Heavy on and this somebody that wanna give orders but don't want to take them. And they not in no position to like do none of that shit because they themselves got too much pain to transmute here. Because it's like this somebody that be like, yeah, I got heart. I can do this. I can do that. And it's like, okay, you going to have enough heart to transmute this pain? Because whoever you are, you already predicted something was going to happen here. Whatever it is, you already predicted it. And it's like, maybe like I said earlier, maybe you was timid. Maybe you was shy. Maybe you was paranoid. Maybe things that you that you needed to go through, you didn't want to, you fear. But guess what? You still had the heart to overcome that shit just by having a mustard seed of faith. So whether you didn't do something that somebody said, oh, this person can't do it. Okay, that's fine too. But guess what you have done that this person doesn't even want to fucking attempt to do? Heal. Transmute this pain. They're fucking codependent. They wanted you to do all the work and say, oh yeah, I'll accept your sorry as apology. You call fucking judgment. You know why? Because you can. <laughs> Everyone, the, you have a full dominion over your fucking energy. I did that video last, I want to say last summer. And that wasn't even, I didn't even pull no cards. That was just me speaking. You have full dominion over your energy. And somebody don't like that shit. We got benefactor, grace, and generosity. Movement toward adventure here. Somebody they wanted they wanted to stay asleep with this fallen angel spiritual narcolepsy. And they gonna be waiting too with the gestation period, they're gonna keep waiting. That's that three of wands. Cause again, like I said, this somebody they be like, Yeah, I got heart, I can do this, I can do that. Okay, well, we waiting or not. Cause while somebody is waiting for you to like fall. It's you're you're going to be risen. Oh we 1963 is significant. Charity organization. <clears throat> Rising above the fray. We. <laughs> we. Closing door with the completion here. Whatever this is, because somebody either waited too long to do something or not do something here, this is over. Closing door. Could be really closing out um, a lot of cycles faster than expected, too. Look 
What did he say? Toby, Toby and, and Nigby. He said, learn yourself <clears throat> before you before you learn yourself in school. Some shit like that. That's also the hermit energy is self-discovery. Somebody could really like really be discovering about themselves, like, damn, I, I am this toxic ass person, or or I do have a whole lot of problems. And it's like, well, motherfuckers were trying to tell you that shit, but you wasn't listening, you see? There's somebody who feel like they gonna give the orders or they're going to be the teacher. <clears throat> Whoever you are, Empress, High Priestess, Temperance Energy, you are like the student and the teacher. I did that video a minute ago too. Where I said, I think it was something like um, where like people thought that like, they were teaching you lessons or something like that. But you were learning from them as well, like at the same time. And now you're their teacher. Like it was something like that. Motherfuckers ain't like that shit, yo. They ain't like it. Because whoever that person or people just take how it resonate. What were they actually like teaching you? That would have bought like some type of involvement or growth to your life. That's why motherfuckers walk away. Because whoever in that devil, hermit, hangman energy, they wasn't teaching nobody nothing. This the same motherfucker I've been picking up on that was trying to lead people to the lake of fire. And, and it's like it was like the blind leading the blind, yo. But if you blind and you trying to lead somebody or people to the lake of fire, guess who the fuck going to get in there first? You see? And motherfuckers could have heard that person screaming and everything. And it's like, hold the fuck up. Let me take this blindfold off and actually see what the fuck I'm doing here. And motherfuckers turned around. Because going to the lake of fire, that's not, that's a dark path, yo. Somebody had to be the fucking light. Heavy on the, the people closest to you do you fucking dirty. But what I wanted to say was whoever you are, if people wanted you last or somebody wanted you last, but you still needed to be the light because you yourself had to try to figure out how to fuck to get off of that dark path. So the motherfuckers that was closest to you when you made that pivot turn, okay. <laughs> cause your light, if they, especially if they had a blindfold on, like, cause when you got a blindfold on, this shit still dark. Whoever you are, that's how bright you are. Especially for the people closest to you. Cause they were still able to see that light. For them to make that pivot turn with you. And the motherfucker who felt like they wanted to be the leader. They wanted to be in the control. They done got their ass in the lake of fucking fire, yo. And they could have taken a few people with them. And unfortunately, you cannot worry about them people. You got to worry about the people who want to save themselves. Because that's what you wanted to do. <sighs> so guys, that's the end of the message. Thank you so much for tuning in. And I will talk to you guys on the next one. Peace.